YouTube, this is my uh, crash test and review of the Chinese imitation Fox Titan body armor. About five weeks ago I had a uh, crash at a probably right around 40-45 miles per hour. Going way too fast for conditions. It was dusty and I couldn't see the trail good. Hit a couple of big rocks, which led me off into the woods, the trees, vines, and I believe a vine caught my right handlebar and threw me immediately down onto my left side really hard. But that was good because it threw me back out in the trail. And then I learned how to breathe or practice breathing for about three or four minutes. Uh, the armor held up pretty good. I have a tear, a tear right up in here. All the padding and, and plastic and stuff's fine. Um, I ain't seen any scratches on it, except for what I've just put on it from throwing on the concrete. But uh, one thing that became obvious is the total lack of rib protection underneath your arm, which seems to be where I hit under my arm and my shoulder. Uh, ended up uh, breaking seven ribs. I bruised my lung and had some uh, internal bleeding, but I spent the night in the hospital and all that. I guess a little tear right there. Um, there was a strap that broke up here somewhere. I don't even know where to have Oh, the strap right here used to be attached over here, but it tore off. I don't know that there's any body armor on the market that would have uh, totally protected me. I can't, I can't say this helped or hurt. The impact was so hard that there was... Uh, I don't really see anything that was going to stop me from breaking something, except for uh, common sense, which I don't seem to have sometimes. Anyways, it seems to be good uh, for what it is. I don't know that there's anything, like I said, that could have saved uh, saved me from any injury, but that's it. Uh, be safe out there. As a follow-up, I crash-tested that body armor so you don't have to. The motorcycle, of course, is fine. It's got a few more scratches on the plastic, but that's what gives them character. I also noticed a uh, crack in the plastic part of my Ken Sean mirror, but incredibly, the mirror <laughs> did not break. That's the part that usually breaks. I'll JB weld that, and it'll be fine. As far as my recovery, I thought I uh, was going to be riding next week, uh, I was healing pretty good. I was healing, healing really good. A lot faster than I anticipated. But I'm finding that it's slowing down and I'm not going to be doing any serious riding for a while. It doesn't, it doesn't feel like. I probably will take the bike out next week and do a little local trail riding, easy stuff. But I'm not going to be hitting the swamps or doing any lifting of motorcycles out of the mud. And I separated my shoulder about five years ago on a bicycle wreck and re-injured it when I, when I had this wreck. So i got to go see a specialist about that and see what's going on with that. That means that I will not be making a whole lot of riding videos. Probably none for a while. But I'll be uh, watching your videos, so put them up.